Lillian says I'm a coward. Uh, a coward? Why? The neighbor took our ball one day when it bounced over into his yard, and I was too afraid to take it back. I'm sure he would have given it back to you without a lot of trouble. But he has a dog that can bite very hard. He bit Joey once, and he cried and bled. I don't like blood at all. It makes me kind of sick. Then Dad was mad at me because I ran away. You want to know what he told me? He said, it's better to stand your ground than to flee. Because then you're able to see the victory or defeat, and you can tell the tale. If you run away, you can't tell nothing. There's nothing wrong with fear. Knowing your own limits keeps you on your toes. I've seen many warriors die because they were too arrogant, too sure of themselves. Incorrect. Fear hinders ascension. But since you seem to think that you know better, I will show you what it means to feel true fear. And once this is over, you will know your place again, Halfbreed. How annoying. Is everything okay? What are you doing here? I couldn't stop him. I came to help you. Makito, oh, this is too dangerous for you. Leave with Quillen and go home before your mother gets worried. But Dad, what if you need me? What if you lose? You'll have to flee, Rukito. I'm not a coward. I'm... There'll be no other choice. I'm not a- Rukito. I'm not a coward. Rukito. I'm not a coward, Dad! There'll be no other choice! I want a story to tell! Damn it, Rukito, I said leave! Now! <sighs> Come on, kiddo. Let's go. <sighs> Look, half-breed. The problem is this. You do not comprehend what you're facing. I, on the other hand, understand this situation very well. I have seen your method of trickery before, and that lowly heroic facade gets us nowhere. I will now bring a predictable reaction to your attention. Ah! 
Whoa! Look at him! You understand that feeling, right? Let him go! He isn't a part of this. Shut your mouth, dog! You don't want me to snap his neck now, do you? Enough! It's between you and me. Yes, it is. Doesn't his life being in peril make this moment, this thing between us, so much more meaningful? I'm warning you. Release him! Is that another heroic admonition? The second problem with your kind is your predisposition to waver in your convictions. Saving someone does not make you heroic. Sacrificing something to achieve your ends does. The value of an offering can be measured and judged by that unto which it is presented. That is a reflection of one's true principles. Your real self will be rendered visible when a sacrifice must be made. The life of this boy, or the lives of millions on this planet, the choice is yours. What should I do? What can I do? In the short fight we had, I know he wasn't going all out. Even with my bluff, I don't think I can take him. Choose now! No Dragon Balls to wish everyone back again. If anyone dies, they'll be lost. No. No! There has to be a way! God, think! I can't let Rukito die. I... I can't do that to Videl. There must be another way. Your life is of no value here. Why, why can't I think of something? One wrong move and he's dead. Your time is up. What will you do, Halfling? I... I have a life. What? Save. Please, help me, Dad. Save him. <laughs> Wrong decision. I choose to save the people. as a child. It still hasn't gone away. But that other part of me is still inside. It never went away.
think he'd use his emotions to transform like the other Saiyans, but he did exactly the opposite. He tuned out his emotions to ignite a state of primitive instinct. Hmm. I wonder if he can even think straight in that form. such a pharaoh to mind the state like a simple savage is hardly a policy for victory. Yes, do it! Go on. Evil does not bring forth justice. As I expected, even the blood of his son couldn't anger him enough to kill his adversaries. <laughs> I didn't want to use all of that power so quickly. I overexerted myself. But, on the bright side, something is off about his transformation. I can't put my finger on it, but his attack wasn't nearly as powerful as I was expecting. Regardless, I'm going to avenge my son by any means necessary. He was just a child. You'll pay for what you did to Rokito! You hear me? Visitors. Some energy is approaching fast. <laughs> you all right? I don't know. I don't feel good. Then let's wrap things up here quick and end this. Visitors. 
You're a little late, but nevertheless, I will kill you as well. <laughs> They only want to recruit pure Saiyan blood. I'm permitted to destroy this one before he ruins my plans. Well, well, well. What do we have here? You're fast! But very easy to read! Why are you running? Survive this. They have their hands full with the other Saiyans. This is my fault. Don't lose hope, Krillin. There's always hope. I can't heal him. He's already dead. Not this again. It's only gonna get worse and worse. Kayo Mazoob, 